Hi guys, this is Neha and welcome back to Target Study YouTube channel. Thanks to the ever expanding business world that has made a degree in business management. The first choice for every graduate from whichever stream he or she is. And to get this master's degree in business management, everybody has to compete to get admission in a some of the best business schools in India. And common management admission test is one such management entrance exam that can help you grab a seat in some of the best management institutes. So in this video, I'm going to give you an insight into all the aspect of CMAT exam. Like what CMAT exam exactly is, what are the eligibility conditions to take CMAT exam, what is the syllabus of CMAT exam, what is the pattern of this exam, how can you apply for CMAT exam, its examination fee, institutes accepting CMAT scores, and much more. If you are interested to know all this about CMAT exam, then watching this video till the end can be a worthy investment for you. So without wasting much time, let's get into this very first question. What is Common Management Admission Test? CMAT acronym as Common Management Admission Test is a national level common admission test conducted by National Testing Agency once in a year for facilitating institutions to select suitable students for providing admission to all the management programs approved by AICTE. The CMAT score is accepted by all AICTE approved institutions, universities, colleges, affiliated colleges, etc. What are the eligibility conditions to take CMAT? All those candidates who want to take CMAT exam should have a bachelor's degree or equivalent from a recognized institute. However, those candidates who are appearing in their final year of qualifying examination can also apply for CMAT exam, subject to the condition that their result will be declared before commencement of admission for current academic year. Besides, the candidate must be a citizen of India and there is no age restriction for appearing in CMAT. What is the syllabus of CMAT? In CMAT, questions are asked from language comprehension, quantitative techniques and data interpretation, logical reasoning, and journal awareness. What is the pattern of CMAT? Conducted by National Testing Agency, CMAT exam is a computer-based test consists of 100 questions carrying 400 marks equally divided among the four sections that are language comprehension, quantitative techniques and data interpretation, logical reasoning and general awareness. Each correct answer will fetch four marks and each incorrect will be penalized with a negative marking of one mark. The total time provided for taking this computer-based online exam is 180 minutes. How to apply for CMAT? Candidates can apply for CMAT online only by visiting the official website that is www.cmat.nta.nic.in. There is no other mode than online mode and only one application is to be submitted by a candidate. More than one application submitted by a candidate will be rejected. Before applying for CMAT, you should have ready with all your qualification details, scanned clear passport photograph in JPG or JPEG format, scanned clear signature in JPG or JPEG format, a valid email ID as all communication will be made on this email ID, a valid mobile number as all information via SMS will be sent to this number, a valid debit or credit card or net banking account for online payment, a printer connected to your system to print confirmation page. No correction can be made at a later stage after submission on an application. No change will be accepted through offline mode that is through fax or application including email etc. Once you are ready with all the documents and instructions, you need to follow some steps. And the first step is to visit the official website of NTA CMAT, that is www.ntacmat.nic.in and click on the link named as New Registration. An application number along with the password will be sent on your registered email address. Now use this application number and password 
to log into your CMAT account. Fill in the online application form and note down the system generated application number. Upload scan images of candidate's passport size photograph and candidate signature in JPG or JPEG format. Make payment of fee using credit or debit card, net banking, UPI, Paytm and keep proof of fee paid. Take at least four printout of confirmation page after successful remittance of fee and then choose the city for giving the examination. What is the registration fee for CMAT? Registration fee for CMAT is rupees 1400 for general and rupees 1000 for general girls. Rupees 1000 for general EWS, OBC, non layer boys and girls. Rupees 800 for SC, ST, PWD boys and rupees 700 for girls and rupees 700 for transgenders. Examination fee can be paid by either online mode or by offline mode. In the online payment process, candidates can use credit card, debit card, net banking facility to pay whereas in the offline process, when candidate choose to pay by cash, system generates a pay in slip named as e-chalan, which is payable at the banks across the country. Now I would like to tell you about some of the institutes that accept CMAT score. Although CMAT scores are accepted by more than 1000 plus business schools across the nation, yet some of the best B schools are Jamnal Al Bajaj Institute of Management Studies, Mumbai, Sidhanam Institute of Management Studies and Research and Entrepreneurship Education, Mumbai, Great Lakes Institute of Management, Chennai, Goa Institute of Management, Goa, and KJ Sumaya Institute of Management Studies and Research, Mumbai. What is the validity of CMAT exam result? CMAT exam result is valid for one year only. It will help you get admission in the year you have taken it. That's all from this video guys. I hope you find this video informative. For more such videos, subscribe Target Study YouTube channel. And to get regular notifications, hit the bell icon. Thank you for watching.